Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of VizRT Tuesday Tutorials. I am your host Richard Evans. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Today I'd like to show you how to stream from your TriCaster to Instagram. Now, typically on Instagram, when users go live, they are just, you know, using their smartphones to go live. But going through a few easy steps, you can use TriCaster and have a full-fledged video production on Instagram. So, let me show you how it's done, son. All right, all right, all right. So, I am on my TriCaster 2 Elite, ready to start logging into Instagram. So, uh, first things first, as you may or may not know, Instagram, whenever you go uh, live, is going to be in a vertical format here. So, I currently have my session, uh, my TriCaster 2 Elite, set up in a vertical session so that I can be displaying all my video properly through Instagram. Okay? So, let's go ahead and take a look here. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to the streaming and coding side of things and let's go ahead and I'm going to make a new preset and I'm going to just put in here custom and from here I'm just gonna type in Instagram you can call this whatever you want but yeah okay cool all right so I have that one set up let's just go ahead and close that for the time being because we don't need it at the moment so uh, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go to a web browser and let's go and visit Instagram all right, so let's go ahead and just go to Instagram.com. Dot, dot, dot. All right, and then from here, just put in your username and password for whatever you have. So uh, let's see here. Let me grab my information. This is just a throwaway account that we have here. So don't bother following me because that's not mine. Okay, so let's go ahead and just log in there. I got my username and password. All right, so now that we're in here, let's just go ahead and I'll hit save for that. Not now. And no, not now on these either. Okay, so uh, from here, from inside of your profile, uh, what you can do if you like, go to uh, create, you'll see here first thing I want to show you is whenever you do this, this will just allow you to upload posts here. But what we're going to do is we're going to change that create side of things and turn that into a way for you, us to uh, make a, uh, to, to post all of our video live from uh, TriCaster. Okay. So what, how we're going to do that is we'll go down to the bottom here on our settings. Size. We'll hit more and then we'll go to settings. All right. And then from here, We'll just go all the way down to, where is it? Account types and tools, all right? So currently I have this set up to just be a, a regular old common uh, Instagram account. So what we need to do is need to switch this over to a professional account to give us access to the RTMP stream on the live side of things. So this doesn't cost anything. Again, this is just, a, just some random uh, Instagram account that we created for this example uh, today. So I'll just go ahead and switch that to a professional account. And you can either set this up to be a creator or business, however you want to do that. Let's just go ahead and set that as a creator. All right, hit next, and we're gonna make some art. Okay, click done from there. All right, so that's pretty much it. That's all you have to do to turn into a creator account. All right, so I'll go ahead and click done from here. And now when I get back over to this side of things, check it out. I can go to create, and now I have an option for live video. Yeah, that's what we want. Okay, so uh, from here, let's go ahead. I'm just going to type in test. We're not doing anything super fancy today. I just really want to show you how you can get in here. All right, and then uh, from here, this drop down allows you to either uh, practice uh, doing uh, your uh, live streaming, or you can go ahead and just make that public and just start streaming right away. It's kind of up to you uh, how you want to do this. But I'm going to go ahead and hit public from here. All right, and then we hit next. And check it out. This is all the information that we need to get this done. All right, so let's go ahead and we'll just copy the stream URL first. All right, now uh, from here, let's go back to our streaming encoder. So I'll go to stream here and let's go down to Instagram and I'll open up the gear icon for that and go back to how when we first started this. Uh, so from in here, I'll just put in the server address. All right, and now we need to get the stream ID. So I'll go back to my web browser I don't need that. Let's see, you get the stream key right there. So we'll get the second one. And then I will put that into the stream ID. There you go, and you are done. Now you can put in your username and password, though I've seen from here I can stream without that because once you're in, you're in. So let's just go ahead and leave those blank. All right. And then from here, we'll go ahead and close that. And then I'll start my stream. 
All right, so that looks like that is already going, but there is a second step to this. So now that you're streaming, you are basically pushing your video over to the Instagram side of things, but now we need to tell Instagram to actually go live, okay? So let's go back to our web browser, and I like to do that the hard way, apparently. And as you can see, our video from my program is coming in right now. It's a little bit delayed, but again, that's just how, you know, when you're pushing it to a, a streaming platform, sometimes that happens. So uh, from here, we'll just say go live, and boom, now we are live. Now what's cool about this now is uh, you can then see your different comments coming in here, uh, et cetera. They won't be displayed on screen on here, but this will still allow you to uh, uh, communicate with your audience, et cetera. But this is how you can get a fully fledged TriCaster video to your followers. So again, you can add graphics, so you can add your virtual sets, whatever you want, sky's the limit here. And of course, when you're ready to end your video, all you have to do is click on end live video and you are good to go. Uh, so a, a really great way to get your message out to your audience on social media by pushing your stream from TriCaster to Instagram. So I highly recommend playing around with this. And of course, have some fun. Hey, ain't that awesome? Another fantastic way to get your show out to social media. Now you can find more tutorial videos like this one by subscribing to the VizRT YouTube channel at youtube.com slash VizRT official. You can also find more information about VizRT products and services by contacting your local VizRT partner or visiting our website, VizRT.com. And you can also get professional training with VizRT products by signing up for Viz University at VizRT.com slash community slash Viz dash university. And if you're posting your work using VizRT products on social media, make sure that you tag us using the hashtags VizRT, TriCaster, and 3Play. And now you can stream it on Instagram so we can see it there too now. Hey, right? So we love seeing what y'all are up to. Uh, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon for another episode of VizRT Tuesday Tutorials.